the number one player in the world recently got absolutely exposed. From him saying some of the most racist things I have ever seen, all the way to scamming people out of 10,000 Robux. So today we're going to talk about the disturbing history of Cloud, who has beaten all of the best players inside of the world. But all of this madness starts with the simple 1v1 and it was materia versus cloud who are both debatably tied for the best players inside of the whole entire world so this 1v1 is pretty much the biggest 1v1 of all time because it decides who really is the best player in strongest battlegrounds but what happened after it was absolutely insane so materia right here fought cloud and he beat him 10 to 8 which was a very close game but then cloud got very very mad because of apparently a really big ping issue and if you guys don't know by now ping is a pretty big part of strongest battlegrounds because it detects if you hit a move or not before somebody else sees it on their screen so pro players always try to have as close as ping as possible and that's what happened in this 1v1 as you guys see boomy right here just said that he has less than 100 ping and both of these guys were playing on eu servers and materia is supposed had 120 ping so materia actually had the downfall but all of a sudden after materia won boomy started complaining about ping and he first started off with just saying i hate you but we know things are about to take a very wild turn and that's because boomy as you guys see right here started complaining all of a sudden that he had 100 to 140 ping and started saying that the 1v1 was unfair the whole entire time but materia Materia was smart and him and another clan owner named Karma found some evidence on Boomy that he actually had pretty low ping and as you guys see Boomy submitted a recording right here of the 1v1 and if you guys zoom into right here you will notice something pretty crazy that Karma found out and it's the fact that he actually had 90 ping uh, instead of the 140 that he was talking about and complaining on that's why the reason that he lost so Boomy was already proven wrong on how he was trying to cheat out of a way of saying that he didn't actually lose. And that's when Boomy became very, very mad. And right away, he actually quit the game, which was a crazy announcement. And you guys might be like, why did he quit? It was just a simple 1v1. Well, he quit because Materia was now counted the best player in all of Strongest Battlegrounds. And that was confirmed just by like Karma, who is a very well-known clan leader. So now it was known that Materia is the best player. And Cloud did not like that at all. Which led him to quitting the game. And he said that he's no longer going to play. And he said some more crazy things that pretty much solidify his leaving forever. Because if he comes back, he will get absolutely cancelled. So we'll talk about some stuff he did whenever he got mad. Because it's absolutely outrageous. But the reason it's so insane why he left. Is because he's done so many things and taught so many techs. He's literally taught some of the most famous techniques inside of the game. Just like the Garu tech, which looks absolutely insane. And he's been playing this game for months. So the fact that he left is insane big news. Because I also didn't tell you guys something else. He is also the owner of one of the best clans on the planet. And he just left it like it was nothing. And I mean it that he left it. Like he's officially gone. Because if you guys didn't know, he literally gave someone else the permission to the Discord server for the clan. Look, he literally says that he passed ownership to Lee. So this is pretty serious. And you guys can tell that Cloud is very mad. And it might be true that he's no longer going to play. But I mean, this man literally had his clan in his username. I think it is called APX. But I did see him online earlier today. So maybe he is making a return. I don't know. But this is sure serious news giving someone else ownership of a very big clan. But right before he left, he said some of the most wild things I think I've ever seen in Strongest Battlegrounds. And as you guys saw before, he started saying this, which is actually insane, and he was spamming it. And he's recently also changed his username. We don't know what's going on with this man. This man is going everywhere. But he sure is insanely mad. But we still haven't got to the scamming part where he stole thousands of dollars. But this stuff on itself is already more than enough to get everyone to hate you all just because this man had a 
little ping problem and lost. Maybe they could have rematched. I don't know if Materia would have done that. To be honest, guys, Materia is kind of a sketchy guy too. So I bet there's another side that Boomy hasn't told us yet that is probably very important. But so far by this ping evidence, he does look pretty bad on his side. But I think Boomy should release something to defend himself. But I don't know if he can defend himself from all the scamming that I'm about to show you guys. Which gets pretty crazy. But before we get to the scamming, make sure you guys subscribe and like because I'll be giving away tons of game passes let's actually give away vip right now and let's give it to this play right here there we go we'll give him early access but the horrible scamming starts where he charges five to ten k robux in order to just join his clan and he says after two weeks it turns it to 10k now this is actually a solid offer because he supposedly say that you're going to fight good people and get better because they have the best players now this is very true they do have some in absolutely insane players inside of that server but some really weird stuff happened because someone by the name of lily gave boomy the 5k that he asked for and she said will you allow me in and obviously as you guys see it says right here yeah he will and he supposedly say that other people have paid to also get into there so it's a very high privileged server that a lot of people tried to get into so lily said all right and she bought the pass as you guys see it says inventory owned and as you guys see it is 100 she did buy the pass for 5,000 robux which is actually a pretty crazy amount of robux but this is where it takes a very 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 dark turn and that's because boomy says bro it didn't go through i can't let you in now if you guys don't know what's going on boomy is trolling lily right now and he's acting like he did not get the payment even though he very obviously did in this rose lily's suspicions right away as you guys see she said dude why the heck are you scamming because booby actually said it was glitch and it was deleted or some kind of bug happened but that obviously didn't happen and once he was done trolling finally and admitted it he sent a fake discord server even though she paid 5k robux as you guys see it's a fake one i mean there's zero members in here and look lily noticed right away saying that's not the actual apx and he says how do you know so he He's still going with the act that APX is actually just him or some weird thing. He's still trolling her even though she paid the 5k Robux and it's been days. And she said because you're the only one in APX. And he says it's the only one me in there. So he's just straight up lying to her now just to try to get these free 5k Robux without her even joining the server. And then look all of a sudden he says bro I'm joking you're such a crybaby oh my gosh. And he finally sent the actual server and Lily said that she has some kind of trust issues. But yeah, Boomy was trolling her insanely hard. And most people thought that it was a scam. But who knows? We don't have Cloudy side yet. And maybe Lily's maybe a terrible person or someone. We have no clue right now. But what happened next is actually shocking also. He doesn't stop scamming. Because once she joined, she did not have any access to any single general like discords. For example, if we go to Yielding Arts, as you guys see, you get all the like access to all of these different roles. And she didn't. But she didn't really care and she says, will I at least be trained or what? Because Lily wants her 5k Robux earned. I mean, that's literally 50 freaking dollars, bro. And Boomy said, bro, do you think that everyone joins Apex gets trained? Only the good people. Now, Boomy's literally just exposing himself more and more. How he doesn't even want to train everyone, even though that they paid their fair amount of Robux. And then the next day, he literally banter from the server, which is actually insane bro so she got completely scammed out of her money now once again maybe she did do something really bad and she just got banned for rightful reasons but right now it's looking that boomy literally just scammed the living crap out of lily but that's not even the worst part about boomy the worst part about him is his hate to races and him nuking servers just like apparently a guy by name of kaden was nuking roblox groups as his name is kaden apx and he should get banned from APX permanently, which Karma is saying. And if you guys don't know what's going on, I think Kaden might be an alt of Boomy. I don't know, but he is from APX. So he is representing Boomy. And Boomy could have 
put this nuke rate on the group and asked everyone inside of their discord server to rate it which is pretty messed up thing to do so then karma goes to boomy and say please kick out that guy that was actually hacking us and boomy says that he banned him but this was a complete lie and he actually made him another alt account and literally rated him again and boomy completely supports it whenever he does this which is actually insane and a lot of people are actually exposing boomy right now because he's just running from every single 1v1 right now and just there's something going on inside of boomy's mentality but make sure you guys subscribe and like if you guys want a game pass and hopefully boomy uploads his side of the story but click this video if you guys really want to find out who the best player is in strongest battleground